Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I know it's been a while, um, I had things happen, life happens, things got in the way, no excuses. Here I am back again to make videos for you. What I thought we would do for this first video back um, is just a 50 fun facts that you don't know about me. Uh, some of you might know these things, some of you may not, uh, but I thought I'd do 50 facts about me. Let's just jump right into it, shall we? And let's get into the 50 fun facts. All right about it, let's do it. I love SpongeBob SquarePants. I love watching SpongeBob SquarePants. I love buying things with SpongeBob SquarePants on them. I love SpongeBob SquarePants. A lot. I love putting ranch on everything. True story. We went to this place in St. Louis that was dedicated to different ranch dressings, and I was in heaven. I forgot the name of it. It's like, oh, Twisted Ranch. Oh my God. So good. If you live in St. Louis, check out Twisted Ranch. I am deadly afraid of clowns. Can't stand them to the point of crying. Cannot stand clowns. Deadly afraid of them. But I like Astro the Clown. Weird. I have to fall asleep with the TV on. It has to be on. It has to be very low volume where I can just kind of hear it, but not a lot, but just a little bit of volume so I can hear it. Good white noise. But on top of that, I like to fall asleep with a fan on. And I like the sound. It's not always necessary that I want the fan on me, but I like the sound. Weird. I am not a huge fan of roller coasters. I can do like a really mild roller coaster, but like the true thrill seekers, like the Mamba here in Kansas City, can not do it, will not. I was once homeless for about two months. I worked my ass off, saved up my money, got myself a $400 a month one bedroom apartment in the shitty part of town, but it was mine. I had a house over my head, a house over my head, I had a roof over my head, and look at me now. I love to sew, true story. I actually own a company making Star Wars costumes, as well as pretty much anything you see Regina in, she's probably made it. I have never been out of the country, and for my first trip to out of the country, abroad, I would love to go to Ireland, because you know, Irishmen. I sometimes like to sit down in the shower. I don't know why, sometimes I like to sit down and let the water just run over my whole body, because they get me all at once, sit down, kind of curl up in a fetal position, and just feel the warmth all over my skin. I didn't see Star Wars until I was like well into my 20s and now I can't imagine my life without it. It's crazy to think that I fell so hard into the fandom so fast. I bite my nails a lot, a whole bunch, an unhealthy amount, but not as bad as my best friend. I can't type without looking at my hands. I have to look down. I even took computer classes and they put a little thing over your hand where you can't look at it, but I always peeked under it and I just, I, I still to this day cannot type without looking down at my hands. I didn't go on my first cruise until last year. Had a good time and we're going back on another cruise in October. Family, best friends, food, fun, water, love. It took me four tries to win Miss Game Missouri and I'm very proud of that because I learned something new each time that made me be able to be the best Miss Game Missouri I could possibly be. I won an award for being pretty. Yeah, I'll, I'll say it again. I won an award for being pretty. You're welcome. I like the taste of coconut, but I don't like coconut shavings. The moment you put coconut shavings inside of a candy or on top of a cake, mm -mm, forget it, can't do it, finito. I don't like dark chocolate. Don't like the taste of it, it's disgusting. I don't like loud chewers. People who like chew and smack belong on the pasture with the cows, girl bye. Even though I stand over six feet tall, I've never played basketball, ever. Stop asking. I'm allergic to seafood, deadly allergic. Can't even be in the same room as it if it's cooking. Very allergic. I probably shouldn't tell people that, especially if I get enemies. They're gonna mail me a packet with seafood on it or something. But I can smell that shit. I am addicted to candy. I am a candy freak. I'm trying to lose this weight, and that's my biggest, biggest thing is candy. I love to snack. I love to chew on things. I love to just have candy all the time. Candy, 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 candy. Addicted to candy. I've never done drugs in my life, ever. Not even once. Pop's not a drug. My favorite Pokemon of all time is Squirtle. I think fairies are real. To this day, I believe in fairies. When I was a young kid, I thought I was a witch with magical powers. True story. I once peed in a cubby at elementary school. You know the cubby that had you put your little backpack and your lunches and stuff in? I needed to go to the bathroom. The teacher didn't believe me that I needed to go to the bathroom. So she told me to take a nap. And during nap time, I got up and went pee in the cubby. Bye, bitch. I love meeting new people. I love getting to talk to new people. I love this digital age where we can go to Facebook Live and talk to people all over the country. And I hope to someday meet all those people that I've talked to digitally. I still, to this day, have a little bit of stage fright. Every time I go out on stage, I am still a little shaken. I had a really bad when I was in school. Um, and to this day, it really hasn't gone away. I've never been in a fist fight, ever. I know how to drive a stick and I know how to drive it well. My favorite color is purple. Love purple, such a gorgeous color, looks good on my skin. 
Love it. I love to cosplay. I love getting into character. I love walking around Comic Cons and having people take pictures of me. I just really enjoy the attention. And I really enjoy when you do cosplay really well and people are so impressed and so happy to see a character brought to life in person. And that's my favorite part of cosplay. It's not about the attention that I get. It's just that people are in love with the cosplay and the costume that you brought to life uh, in their fandom and it's the most amazing feeling ever. I only wear a size nine and a half shoe for being six foot tall. That's weird, which is great though for Regina because she can wear an 11 or 12. <laughs> I own several lightsabers, tons of them, sort of like this one here. Mm. Mm. Listen to the hum. Oh, this isn't the good one. Oh, well. I love doing charity work. I love the feeling it, get, it puts in me, and I love the feeling that people get from uh, the selfless act that we like to perform. True story, I do charity work year-round dressed as a Star Wars character most of the time, and in October, I donate all my tips to breast cancer. I have an unhealthy obsession with Tinkerbell. I've seen every Tinkerbell movie that they've released about her, and I'm absolutely in love with Tinkerbell. I collect tin lunchboxes. A uh, little tin, vintage, new, whatever they are. Uh, if it's a metal lunchbox or a tin lunchbox, I will buy it, and I will put it on a shelf, and let it sit there and collect dust. I want to be world famous. I want the entire world to know my name. Not only do I want to be famous because I want to be famous and I want people to know me and I want to meet people that goes along with me loving people, uh, but I also want to utilize it to give back to the community. I own more shoes than I can count. True story, both boy and girl shoes. Too many to count. I am borderline a hoarder and it's weird to admit that, but it's hard for me to throw things away. No matter what it is, how big, how small, how worthless it is. Hard for you to throw things away. I am obsessed with Beyonce, but who is it? I own more rhinestones than I know what to do with them. I have two gigantic things filled with rhinestones, and I have no idea what to do with them yet, but I know that someday I will use them all. I can't sleep with clothes on. I cannot. I cannot sleep with a shirt, especially a shirt. I feel like I'm choking at night, and this just talking about it gives me anxiety. I have to sleep either completely naked or just in boxers or boxer briefs or something, but I cannot sleep with clothes on. I don't understand how people can sleep in like nightgowns and pajama pants and jackets and onesies and all that stuff. Nope, just give me nice, bare nothing and sleep. I'm like sleeping like a baby. I don't know Neil Patrick Harris was gay until recently. Like, very recently. Uh, he portrayed uh, Barn or Barney so well and How I Met Your Mother that I was just convinced that he was this straight playboy. I want to meet Ellen DeGeneres so bad. I love her energy. I love her spirit. Uh, you know, send her a message about me. Tell her that Regina Larry wants to meet her. Um, I'm actually going to be uh, trying to get tickets to a taping of her show and I'm probably going to go as Regina if they'll allow it. And finally, I want to be known for doing good and giving back to my community. So I want to be famous, that's true, but I also want that fame to come with the know-how that I am giving back to my community and giving back to those who help me get where I am and that I leave this world a better place because I just did right by humans and by people. Um, and that's my last fact about myself. I want to be famous for the right reasons and give back to my community. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I'm so happy that we made it through that. Again, if you um, are new here, hi and welcome. If you've been here for a long time, thank you so much for supporting and thank you for coming back. Again, today's video, I just wanted to do a quick 50 fun facts about me uh, to get things going. But I have a lot of content planned for this channel, uh, so I cannot wait to jump into a full swing. Uh, next video I'll be posted on Friday, uh, so it is now Monday that I'm posting this video, and I'll post the next video on Friday. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you really like this video, give it a thumbs up. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button down there somewhere. Also hit the share button if you want to, and come back for more, please, because this is only going to get better and better and better and better. Um, and thank you so much for watching. And as always, may the fierce be with you.